Hey everyone, welcome to uh, my video. Um, I'd like to share today some talking points on which also has to do with motivational. Um, and I just want to share some things like as far as how this COVID virus has affected all of us, uh, including uh, the economy, uh, businesses, which also is economy, but it affects us in a way in that we look at ourselves and then we think, okay, we got nothing else to do. We got nowhere to go because everything is either closed or gone out of business or what are we going to do? And then I think, you know, for a while I was at that point, I was thinking, what am I going to do? And then it took a little bit and I was just like, well, I mean, I wrote two books, so now I can work on another book because I have a lot of time. So I started working on another book. And my point here is that if you've had goals that you wanted to set, you know, especially before all of this virus and everything, and, and you know you couldn't because of time and whatever other reason, this whole situation allowed you to have some time and when you're locked at home you can do these things like you can spend more time maybe with your kids or you can write a book or journal about this uh, there's there's many different things that you can do and and sometimes we don't think about it because all we think about is the outside world or all the negativity that's happening yes I know and I realize that's important stuff but we also have to bring ourselves into positive thinking and, and bring a little optimism to our lives so we won't fall into depression um, and also procrastinating too because sometimes we say yeah we're gonna we're gonna do this we're gonna do this and then we spend most of our other time either not doing it or binging on Netflix. Uh, you know, I've I've fallen into that category two category two because you know we're all guilty of you know something. Uh, so I apply this also to myself. Whereas if I have a goal, I know I have to set a time for it. I have to make a schedule for it. And that's what I suggest. Put in on your schedule, put in what you spend a lot of time doing. Do I spend more than two, three hours watching TV? Write it down. Do I spend an hour, an hour and a half playing games on my phone or whatever on Facebook? Write it down. And you add up all that time and then you say, okay, well, this time I can cut it in half and I can use it towards my goal. And it's, I mean, I know it sounds difficult or I, I mean, I myself, I think it's a simple plan because that way you can know how much time you have on your hands and what you can use it for. Um, this is also a way for me to come to you as a one-on-one -on -one. if you have a situation where you need somebody to talk to or you're having troubles uh, accomplishing your goals or for whatever reason uh, I opened up a person-to-person -person chat line and you can come to me at any time of the day and the chat line is www.premium.chat forward slash Izzy Motivated. And you can find me there. And even if, if it's your first time, come to me on Messenger. I'll give you the first time free. And we'll talk about it. See how it goes. If you like it, then we'll talk about other times. You can come to me and we can chat. And hopefully I can 
better assist you and motivate you to get your goals and help you get through this difficult time that we're all facing and you know we can we can try to you know help others as well too because that's my main goal my goal is to help others and i want to help you too so don't be afraid don't be shy just text me on messenger and we'll talk all right thank you everyone for listening uh and for supporting as well and i hope to hear from you soon all right have a great day